Um, and this, this is just, look at that. Hey guys, welcome to um, uh, uh, an, another off the cuff episode of Van Haven TV. And today I just walked in here and see a TTR carbon kit that's ready to go onto a customer's van. Jordan was here, so I had to basically show you in a little bit more detail just how baller this kit is. Now we've got quite a few vans going out now with full TTRCs and um, it's a really good opportunity to show you guys at home what's involved in a full carbon fiber body kit, be it for a transporter or a Ferrari or for a Porsche, whatevs, it's all the same stuff. I just wanna start off with the pinnacle point for me is when you look into the carbon, the way that we've manufactured this is that every single weave is in line. And that is the smallest detail that makes the biggest effect. So when we put the deer, let's use this rear diffuser, as you can see, it's all just carbon all the way through. So this is absolutely rock hard. When we put the rear diffuser into its location, can you see that, Jordan, how all the carbon fiber is perfectly lined up? So this, this three-piece bumper, well, it's actually, no, it's a five-piece bumper. Um, everything is in line. So we've got the diffuser. Just like all performance vehicles, we've got a diffuser overrider. All the carbon perfectly in line. It's a tiny, tiny detail, which is so uber important when the sun hits these things, when they're out on the street. And I'm being all really delicate just because it's just this, this particular kit's having a gloss finish. So it comes in like matte. So the strut, this is raw. So this is how it comes out totally unfinished. So this is just it. I mean, it's so strong, so light. Does, you can't even feel it in your hand, it's incredible. Um, yeah, so they, they come in all different finishes. So this is how it comes out, the autoclave, which is basically just a normal raw carbon, which is really nice. Gloss, like what's going on this particular van, we do blended, where we actually tint the carbon fiber. Um, there's some really good shots on our socials of that. Um, and obviously painted, which, had a couple of people ask for a fully painted carbon kit. We've got a, a pure grey van going out, um, and that's going to have that's going to have a painted carbon kit. He just likes the shape. This is the TTR front kit splitter. Now this is a five-piece splitter. This is obviously the main the main bit. It's really delicate, it's really, no, it's not, it's rock hard, but it's a very delicate bit of styling. You know, us guys at Van Haven, we've always tried to have quite a subtle kit, right back from the Haven 6 on the old T6, the TTR, the, the, trans, the, the refined transporter we do, it's all quite delicate, it's quite refined. We, we tend to like our vans to look, to whisper, I suppose. Look at that though, behind, it's incredible. So this will all go through finishing now. So once it goes onto the van, it won't actually be finished with sort of like some of this resin bits here. This will all come off. And um, yeah, it's, it's just, it's so light. It's amazing. We've got a real obsession with this stuff. You know, we started playing with carbon fiber 18 months ago. Jay now knows more about carbon fiber than than, than anyone I know, it's ridiculous. This piece here, I talk about this little piece here. That is the, one of the parts of the rear bumper. And this go basically goes around the exhaust system. 
and what makes it look so smooth and subtle and, and just fits perfectly. That, I cannot express to you how much of a ball ache making that is. But now it's done, it looks really cool. And we've got wheel arches obviously coming down there. Um, slightly wider than the average transporter wheel arches that you commonly see on all the swampers and stuff. So we've, we've extended them out, but it was a delicate exercise because of the sliding door. As you know, we've only got a certain amount, so we've had to have a slightly different rake on those. Um, and this, this is just, look at that. And I'm sorry, it's just a video of me showing you loads of pieces of carbon fiber of a body kit. But when I walked into work today, I just thought I had to share this because it's just pornographic. It is just absolutely epic. I love the backside of these things just as much because it really does show, it really does show how we've made it. All done by hand. Um, and then we pressure, we pressurize it in an autoclave, a hundred and, 20 and about sort of, I don't know, I think it's about 100 bar of pressure. So it's exactly the same as if we were doing something for a high end race car or something in the, in the aerospace world. It's exactly the same, but absolutely rock hard. And this, this isn't an entire rear bumper, so this is just a little lip. It just fits in there. And as you can see, it's got a lovely bulbous rear end to follow that side skirt round. Um, and yeah, completely, completely unique bit of kit. Very nice, very nice. Definitely not a replica of anything we've ever seen before. Um, overriders have obviously been used for years through all the VW Audi group and, and Porsche, etc. Um, and I love this, I love this piece. It's really nice. Just loads of close up pictures of Lush Carbon, right? The lacquer work on these things is, um, is a work of art. It's really, really hard to get this type of thickness and toughness and shine out of, uh, out of a lacquer. And the guys have done it brilliantly. We've got our new booth now, which means we don't get any shit in the paintwork. So it's really, really lovely. That's me waffling for a few minutes about just how much I love the TTRC carbon kit and coming into in here this morning and seeing that it's just freaking epic. Cool. There you go. Cheerio guys, I better go and do some work I suppose.